Okay guys, today we're going to talk about pumping down the line to generate speed, to make it around sections, and to complete maneuvers like turning, cutbacks, and hitting end sections with speed. Because pumping is all about generating speed, which is a huge part of surfing better and having more fun. So I want you to notice the positioning of my knees and my body. And then we're going to talk about the line that we draw on the wave. So when we're pumping, we want to be low and compressed. So I'm bending my knees. I'm low in an athletic stance. And I'm going to choose a line that's high on the wave, okay? Because that's where all the speed is. So if you split the wave up into thirds, I want to be in the top third of the wave because that gives me the most real estate to come down and complete maneuvers like a roundhouse cutback that you're going to see at the end of this wave. It's also where the curve of the wave is going to allow for me to generate the most speed. So my back foot's on the rail, my head's up, I'm looking down the line, and I'm going to compress low and then extend. All right, and all this is happening at the top third of the wave. So I'm going to just play this forward a bit so you can see the compression and extension that I'm talking about, and then we'll slow it down, okay? Compress, extend, low, extend, compress, extend, and then that's going to set me up for a maneuver at the end here, okay? So let's go back through that slow motion. So I'm dropping in, I'm going to compress by bending my knees, getting low, and then springing off the bottom. And I say the bottom, but it's not the bottom of the wave, it's the bottom of the top third of the wave, if that makes sense. So I'm low. I'm compressing here to generate a move back up towards the top third of the wave. I'm releasing a little bit with my front foot as I compress with the back, okay, and extend. So compress, extend, compress, extend, compress, extend. And now, because I was high on the wave, as I drop down, I have more real estate to come down, do my bottom turn by compressing, and then come back into the pocket. If you want to learn more about turns, you're going to watch our tutorials on turns, but this is about generating speed, okay? So again, I want you to watch the compression and extension. Compress, extend. Compress, extend. Okay? Now, a lot of people will have questions about, you know, weight distribution. You want to just try it. Just try to compress and extend. We are putting a little bit more weight on the back foot as we compress and releasing a little bit with the front. But the important thing is I'm low, I'm coiled up, and then I'm extending, okay? So low, compressing, and then extend. See how my leg gets long and I extend and that's going to help me generate more speed. So I'm going to play this forward and we're going to look at a couple waves of pumping. And then we'll also go over backside pumping. So compress, extend, and that sets me up for a maneuver at the end of the wave there. <clears throat> okay, here we have our head instructor, Yosu. Same thing. He's going to immediately set his line at the top of the wave here, okay? So he's going to set his line because he wants to start generating speed. So he's compressing. Look at his leg, all right? His knee is bent, he's low athletic stance, and then extending. Look at his leg now, it's extended, and he's working towards the top third of the wave, right? See, there he goes. So you're gonna come down towards the middle third of the wave, but then you wanna compress, extend to get back up there, okay? If you're trying to pump from down here, you're not gonna be able to generate as much speed as if we're pumping from the top third of the wave. Compress, extend, and now he's got all that real estate. At the end here, he's coming, he's pumping to come down, compressing for his bottom turn. It sets up that nice cutback at the end, okay? So we'll watch that again from Yosu. Okay, so he's going to compress, extend, compress, extend, and then set up for the nice maneuver at the end of the wave. All right, let's watch another wave here. Low, compress, extend, compress, extend, compress, extend, 
and the wave kind of closes out, but that helped get me in front of the wave that was going pretty fast. So I just wanna show you slow motion here. Back foot is on the rail. If you look at our video on foot positioning, that's very important as well. Front foot middle, looking where I wanna go. Knees bent, compress, and look at me extend out straighter legs. Low, compress, extend out towards that top third of the wave, and then I'm out of there, okay? So now let's look at a couple backside waves, okay? Compressing, little check turn, top third of the wave, same thing, compressing and, and extending, and that sets me up with speed to complete that turn, okay? So I want you to watch right here. I'm low, I'm coming down, getting up towards the top third of that wave, little check turn. Now watch, again, my back foot is on the rail. That's gonna help me get more control of the board, I'm working on the top third. Now this is that release of the front foot. So see how the top of my board is up a little bit because I got back foot pressure, which is helping me to get to the top third of the wave and I'm low in extending. So this is a little extension here as I come here, compressing, extending, compressing, as I come from my bottom turn, now, again, being at the top third of the wave sets me up with all the real estate to complete that top turn there, okay? So watch, it's a little bit more subtle on this wave, but I'm, I'm low and compressed off the bottom turn. I'm releasing and extending to help me come up. Compressing, extending right there again. Compressing extending right there and that helps me generate the speed to come for that top turn okay and again compressing extending compressing extending gives me all the real estate to come back and wrap it all the way back to the pocket okay guys and then let's watch this last one top third of the wave little pump there extending coming down little check turn all right, so I'm gonna play this through again one more time. There's a lot of nuances in pumping, but I really want you just to try it, okay? Try that compression and extension and try to be at the top third of the wave, okay? Compress, extend, compress, extend, low, compress, extend, and then real estate to complete my cutback, okay? Let's watch the next wave, Yosu. Right here, compressing, extending, compress, extend, real estate to perform this nice little snap. Compress, extend, compress, extend, compress, extend. You're gonna be saying that in your sleep as you learn to generate speed. It's gonna help you make sections, get around this wave and complete maneuvers like that with speed, okay? Compress, extend, top third of the wave with speed to wrap it back. That's really what this is about, is about generating speed so we can complete maneuvers and make it in front of fast waves or make it around a whitewater section. Hope you guys enjoyed. Come visit us in Nosara, Costa Rica, our all-inclusive stand-up paddle surf camps run from November to August every year. That's our season. And we'd be happy to have you down to help you learn to pump faster. Or if you just want to learn to catch your first wave or complete more radical maneuvers like snaps and roundhouse cutbacks, backside end sections, and much more. Thanks for watching.